and I'm live. Okay, simple fact time. I will not hide. I have nothing to hide. Uh, CJ Grisham with Open Carry Texas OCT has been in my house. This can be verified by multiple people. But if you're so astronomically stupid as to not be able to ascertain information which I have freely given, I will give it now. The address which I'm standing in right now as we speak is 2026 Naple Chase Crest Drive. Excuse me. Naple Chase Crest Drive, Spring, Texas, 77373. Naple, as in Nancy, Naple Chase is one word. Naple Chase Crest Drive. And if you're worried about vague threats, uh, if you think I'm worried about vague threats, I'm not. If, uh, somebody hasn't already given you this information i will actually type out and pin in the comment section the correct spelling of my address that's pretty much it i await your arrival at your earliest convenience uh let me close by asking you this, because I think on behalf of the body, I think each of the 31 members talk about family. So we're concerned about their safety and political well-being. You're familiar that some of our colleagues have started receiving mailers from gun proponents in recent days. Including myself, yes, sir. You received one? Asking me to vote for this bill, okay. yes. They don't know you're the sponsor? Anyway, I assume you don't approve of that. Senator, but the, the, the campaign, right to... Uh, uh, campaigning and threatening of members... Now, that's a different they're story. Doing their job, I think, is reprehensible. Mm -hmm. And a couple of them have actually been... People have gone to their home and, and physically offended them. So, Senator, I, I'd like to stay on the bill, on the questions, if we could. Yes, sir. Thank you. Senator, as you know, we have a right to free press. Uh, it is not a right to assault verbally in any manner, violate an individual, um, threaten an individual. Sure. Those are crimes, and they should be prosecuted if they happen. Well, I just hope you'll join with me and, and others to say that it's just not good to try to intimidate members to vote a certain way while we're meeting in this session. I don't think any member on this floor can be intimidated to vote a particular way. Well, I beg to differ, but that's your opinion. Thank you.